There she is. Sharon, welcome. Thank you. Welcome. We're glad you're here. Thank you so much, Brian, for giving me the opportunity to talk about something that's very dear to my heart. That's great. We will. That is the exhibition at the Bosque Museum, which is the Bosque Seven, a Texas tradition. Bosque Seven. Now, I'm I'm from Tennessee. Uh, Matt has told me a little bit about the Bosque Seven. Well, the the Bosque Seven is a group of artists who are nationally acclaimed. They have uh, been living in this area since the 20s and never have they showed their original art together as a group. So this is very important for the community. This is the first time the community will have an opportunity to see these seven. Well, actually, I will have to say these five living artists because two are deceased. And uh, the show will begin um, with a gala champagne opening on Friday the 21st of this month. It will be open to the public the next day and will run through um, (coughs) November the 5th. So it's, it's, it's a very big coup for our area to be able to showcase these artists. These are renowned artists. They are renowned. They have been, they're always in the biggest uh, shows. We're getting a lot of um, uh, publicity. The art critic from the Dallas Morning News is planning to do an article because they believe this is so important wow. for art in Texas. And the uh, one of the most prestigious art magazines, which is called the Western Art Collector Magazine. Western Art Collector Magazine. And it's the October issue. They have done a really nice uh, article about the show, and there are a number of photographs that will be in the show. Uh, we're going to have a catalog. We've been working on a catalog, which will be available uh, that night. And um, it has been a dream of mine to do this for, for 10 years, and it's taken this long to get it put together. Good. But it was, it was very exciting when I first went to each of these artists, and I told them what my vision was, that we could have this exhibit and have them all together for sure. the first time. And they were just ecstatic. Each one thought this was so exciting to do. And um, so it's it's taken a lot of work to put it together, but it's finally come together. And um, we'll have our opening night, as I said, the gala reception will be right, on, the 21st. on the 21st. What time does that start? It'll, be at, six, it'll be at 6 o'clock, six o'clock. and we're going to have um, I guess you call them heavy hors d'oeuvres. Lots of hors d'oeuvres, heavy lots hors d'oeuvres. of champagne, lots of drinks, and sure. lots of fun. But it's very good for the community because these are such important artists. So it's it's a real coup for the entire community. And we're very pleased that the Bosque Museum is the one that is showcasing these artists so we can see their the different visions of these artists, uh, their impressions of the history of art in our Southwest, not not just Texas. And these um, these artists you might compare to the Russells and uh, the Remingtons of a hundred years ago. These artists have their impression of, so it's of Texas kind of, art. Well, that's it's like Southwest impression of their lives here growing up in this area they all did they all did and they have chosen uh this beautiful area called the painted hills of the Bos- painted hills bosque county and they have all chosen this area uh, to to live and many other artists are moving into this vicinity because uh, and, uh, of the art colony that's here are there are tickets available for the event Absolutely. If you will uh, get online and just go to boskemuseum.org, you can buy your tickets online. Um, 
or get them at the door. But um, we're expecting a very large turnout. I would expect because so. Because this is an unusual event. So and the sooner the, you get tickets, the better. Sounds abs like. Absolutely. Yeah, that, that you ensure your spot there because I'm going to be there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go to this. I love art. Uh, especially something of this magnitude that may never happen again. It probably won't. And another thing, there will be some pieces. I have to interject something here. What's that? My grandmother, Tyra Wallace. Yes, I know your grandmother. Yeah, exactly. And she was a painter as well. You know that, right? And I've heard about the Bosky Seven since I was a little, little kid. I'm sure you have. Well, good, because she was all about that. Yes. She yes. was all about that. And this is a big deal. I mean, you're, you're telling it in a really nice way because you're a very nice lady. But this is a big deal. A I mean, the Bosky deal. 7 is huge. I mean, international. So I just... Absolutely. I, I, don't, I apologize for interrupting. But I oh, just please like, do. I just don't want people to miss that this is a big deal. Yes, okay. for the whole community. Sorry to interrupt, but I just... Oh, it's not, a, it's not a, at all. So make sure and get your tickets and get them <laughs> soon. Right there. Yeah, there we go. And it'll be uh, Friday the 21st. Uh, well, that'll be the opening okay. gala. Mm -hmm. And then it'll be open to the public the next day. Wonderful. Sharon, thank so, you well, so thank, much. Well, thank you, Brian. Um, I, I appreciate your there. giving me the opportunity to talk about it. I'm glad to do it. And we'll see you right. soon. Will you be there opening night? You better. Oh, I certainly will be. Okay. I'm the chairman. <laughs> You're sort of obliged to, but you love it anyway. Sharon, thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Appreciate